who's about to live tweet? We're like, what, like, we're like a minute away from the scandal finale, the season five. Yeah. Scandal season finale. Finale. Woo! Get pumped. You guys, this is it. I'm so excited for you to see it, but I'm also like super sad and bittersweet because this is it. This is the end of season five. Yeah. You guys, I love you very much. I'm excited to see you on the Twitter. Let's break Twitter down. <laughs> Don't break Twitter? Let's break <laughs> Twitter. Let's have our phones and our... Oh, it's time. It's time. You guys, let's do this. Woo! All right. Live tweet time. Oh, yeah. Everybody, um, I am backstage at Jimmy Kimmel. You can tell because that's Jimmy Kimmel behind me. That's also Julia Roberts, but she's not here. Um... <laughs> I don't know her either. Uh, we're backstage, and it is finale night at Scandal. And I'm going to go on Jimmy Kimmel, and it's going to be me, and it's going to be Carrie, and it's going to be Jimmy Kimmel, because the show is called Jimmy Kimmel. And you have to watch, and it's going to be great. And it's going to come on after the finale of Scandal. But before that, you're going to see the penultimate episode of Grey's, which is pretty cool. And it has an ending. Actually, the ending of Grey's, the last two minutes of that show, you're going to want to watch because you're going to see something that you've never seen before on the show, which I'm very excited about. And then you're going to watch the finale of Scandal. And I think that's going to kind of blow your mind. I hope. I hope your mind gets blown. And then you're going to see um, the catch. Does the catch come on tonight? Yeah. Then you're going to see the catch, too. Because I know that there's a two-hour catch next week. So you're going to see the catch. And then next week, you'll see the finale of Grey's and a two-hour catch. And then I don't know what you're going to do for the rest of the summer. So you better, like, stick with us now. Bye. Support. Um, to me, this is a really important event. There are, what do you say, it's been 20 years, 17 years since a woman of color has been in the United States Senate, which is a ridiculous amount of time. And then there was only one. It takes a lot of money to run in the state of California. It's not a knock on doors event, it really is a raise money be on television, make ads, get people to understand what's going on that way event. And getting people to vote is not a simple thing as we all know. And this woman is about something much better and bigger and stronger and more wonderful than um, just wanting to be elected for reasons that don't matter. Uh, as, as our state's cop, top cop, as I love to say, um, she's really been making changes and really been doing things that have really matter and have been really strong. And so to me, it's special that you all came here to hear what she has to say. Um, first, I'm going to let Chris tell you what he has to say. <laughs> <laughs> it's Chris Silverman. Thank you. Thank you. Woo!